Welcome everybody. I'm back to the channel. I'm gonna go through a replay. I'm gonna record the new take, so I'm not gonna try and do a replay. Play by play. As always, a capture practitioner thinks cap first. And barring that microphone stand kick. You cap, you scout, and you automatically get your team advantage. Foes are way back there in the corner, so they're not going to be able to get up here in time. So I'm turning around because I got allies coming in echelon support. And I'm going over to A base. Because I saw out of the corner of my eye that there was the weaker armored ones. And since those four over there are camping and they're sitting back, they're not going to do anything. And... It really didn't look very good for our team at first, but started looking up once I figured out, put him at one shot, so that's going to be crucial, and then I just started to mop up the 140, because that one shot ain't going to risk, because I had a vector on him too, so if he peeked over like he's trying to do, I blocked myself, and if he got out in a position to where I could have got him, I would have killed him. But he never did, so I just mopped up the 140. Clean up, aisle four, man down. And right now, it still wasn't looking all that good, but I was going to go for the TVP. Kind of missed a shot there, but he ducked under. I got mines, though. Got the ram with minimal damage. Got the kill. And I saw the Yo was the only one over in position, so I did some sniping. And as you'll see, missed a couple shots that were just dead on in the armor and they just didn't hit. So I had to reposition to get a better shot at it. Bounce. There's one. So I repositioned since he was targeting the hammer over there. Another one. I don't know what the heck happened there. Just missed. Got the kill then. And then I saw since the two foes were going to the left to go tackle with the hammer, I'm going right. I was hoping that my ally would cap B base, but he went for the wraparound to go get a six. Angle or I'm assuming. He should have capped B when he had the chance. It would have quickened the game. My only concern was to get to the base and cap it. I really don't care about what the foes did. And even if I would have been the only one left, I would have capped that base and I would have went back over to their spawn. I wouldn't have skirmished. Depending on the HP. And I got the cap. Me and an ally, we skirmished. Me and one ally, we actually knocked out four foes. Me and Type 71, we knocked out four foes. So he followed me along. And I supported him. That's proper skirmish tactics right there. And the result... A master badge. I'll take it. <laughs> I could just stop hitting my microphone stand. <laughs> anyway, it was a good round. Every time you get a master badge and a win, it's good. So, I'll see you on the next one. And until cappers reign, campers rule. Cappers reigned here. And hardly any campers in the bunch. Blitz is just made easy that way. Y'all have a good one.